Yo, what's up, people? Matty D of In The Black, where we help you achieve financial, emotional, physical well-being and your, and your uh, relationship coach when it comes to your parents. Now, this is a video that I'm going to, you know, like like most of them, I keep it raw, real. Uh, this was more was inspired. Just got off a call with uh, my own coach. And a lot of this, the work that we that I've done on her, actually all of it deals with, deals with dealing with your emotions, processing emotions, simply feeling them out, which I've talked about in... Many of my videos, and so when it comes to your life, this, this the whole point of this video is that to show you that your feelings aren't bullshit. They're not just this stupid things that we feel for no reason. They're there, and people want to think, oh, don't worry about your emotions. Use your mind. Yes, you can do that, and that helps. But at the end of the day, ultimately, your feelings come out on top every single time. We are emotional creatures. Yes, men, you are too. You think you're not, but you are. Okay, and I'll prove it to you. Guys, like, no, no, I'm not emotional. Well, this is a very graphic example, but guys, when you're getting on with a girl and having sex and you're screwing, and you haven't wrapped it up, there comes a point where you're like, do I pull out, or do I, do I just want to just let it all out? I've been there before, and I'm telling you, as a guy, you will go, I shouldn't do this. Rationally, you know, but the emotion of feeling you're there, you're just like, ah, yeah, that's, that's your emotions kicking in. Your emotions saying, man, fuck it, feel good, it's all good, you'll be fine. And there are people who do that, and there are guys who do that, and that's why you get men and women with babies, with fathers that don't give a shit. Bing. Anyways. But we all are. Your emotions are a big deal. They're a part of your life. They call your world. Like, your emotions. And this, and people, this is really for people who believe in, for spiritual, you know, energy is real. Everything is energy. Einstein said it. It's true. Everything's energy. You are energy. Your emotions are energy. Your emotion stands for, stands for, emotion is short for energy in motion. Your emotions can be measured. They do have a frequency. There's a signal. They can be measured. It's been done. I'll find an article at some point, put it here in the description below. But your emotions are there. They color your world, not only that, but they do attract what's in your life. If you, you for, those are, for those who are familiar with the law of attraction, anything else, Pretty much, if you're feeling good, you'll attract more things that keep keep up, keep, keep up that vibration. You will attract stuff that don't make you feel good, but you can choose to you can choose to continue to expand despite the despite that stuff that comes up. Okay. But the point is that I told this to her. I was like, "Look, yeah, emotions are everything because like they control your world. And like, if based on how you're feeling and what you're what you're not dealing with, you're gonna attract and create more of the same shit based on based on your emotional state. It's true." I mean, talk to doctors. When I think doctors, you know, people who are dealing with disease and stuff, they'll say, hey, be positive, feel good, laugh. Your emotional state creates, you know, everything. And if you've been, and if you, people with depression, they get sick. People have been very negative. If people are angry, get cancer and stuff. Like, if you are not feeling very good, if, you, if, you, if you've seen a constant state of being sad, angry, whatever, your body does not expand. It disintegrates and, and something will manifest. Like, your health will just tank. Over time, it will. But if you laugh more often, smile more often, and just gradually build yourself up and process the emotions, you'll you will become better, and your body, your health will just shoot up. And I say this to you because the work that I do, you know, working people and their parents, the emotions, you have, the emotions that you have not dealt with your parents, they're still there. You can mentally neutralize and think it doesn't and think and think and think that think that it, it doesn't matter. It matters because when you talk to them, there's hot buttons that. Or there, they pressed. You're probably not aware of that. Boom! They get you every time. It's a bitch. Like family, greatest family can be. Family can be a real motherfucker because when you're. I've noticed this because I got a, I got a big fight with my sister yesterday. I'm not gonna lie. Push some buttons. I was like, damn it! And then you think about it. When you're not around family that you don't have issues with, or I'm sorry, when you're, when you're not around family that that you may not that that you may not like. And you feel like you 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 progress in life. You may have gotten married, had children, got a new career. Like let's say you've gotten really far in life. When you're not around them, you're like, wow, I'm good. I, I can hold my own. But then you get around them, and then all of a sudden they put you right back to feeling like shit, to feeling like how you used to feel. And you stare and go, what the fuck? I was really good like five minutes ago, and they just pissed me off. It's because, and this is what happens. There's an unconscious emotions that are there. They push your buttons. Get you to react, and then that's when you feel, you know, like shit, basically. It happens. But that doesn't mean you have to stay like that. You can get rid of that simply by processing emotion. By When I say process, it's simply feeling it out until it's not there anymore. 
and then maybe more in your in your body, but it's all there. It's there for a reason. If you simply do this, I promise you, your parents or anyone for that matter, or anything in life, it won't cause your action. You'll be like, whatever, <laughs> fuck it. Or my or for me, what I like to know is that when I've done this work, I start laughing more often about shit. I'm like, this is funny. It doesn't bother me anymore. It's great. It's great. Wouldn't it be great? Wouldn't it be great to react? That wouldn't it be great that this is why I'm just really not scripted, but wouldn't it be great that when something happens to you that normally has pissed you off, made you sad, instead of that, instead of reacting that way, you respond by laughing. Your life would be like amazing, but this is this is great. It can happen, but people don't get that. You think, oh, that's the bullshit. What is the bullshit? Why are you still hating life? Like your emotions are not bullshit. They are real and they have power and they're affecting your life. In a way, if you're not liking life right now, it's not serving you. It's getting you more of what you're like. I hate this stuff. Why can't it, why why can't it get better? And here's why. Here are the reasons. Okay, I'm keeping it real simple. I mean, there's all the questions you can ask, but your emotions are powerful. They are important. You need to acknowledge that and realize that, like, okay, if I change my emotional state and processing simply feeling emotions, your life will change. I kid you not, it will change. May not overnight change. But you'll feel different. You will be different because you be different. Because you be different. Because you're being different. You're being a different energy. Your life then responds to that. And life rearranges itself based on what you're feeling. What well, comes down to the end of the day. I'm gonna keep it like stupidly simple. It's really what it is. But your emotions are important. Remember that, don't forget that. Anyways, with that, that being said and done, hope this helps. Like this video, and if you feel some someone may get some value from this, please share it. And as usual, hey, want to do coach, 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 coaching, uh, coaching session with me? The link is in the description box below. Hey, we have one free session. Go from there. Love y'all. Get in the black. Deuces.